It's KE7 TRP here. This is uh, George's amplifier, W8QBG. He's uh, recently silent key. And uh, do a lot of work to get this thing back on the air. The, to get a new Variac on the right side tube there. I was able to find one on uh, eBay and install it. Anyways, the amp's up and running now into the dummy load, and I uh, just wanted to take a short video to show you guys how it works. This amp has two 4 1000s in it. One's there. This one's dark on the right side. George designed this amp to work with uh, one tube. You can, you can run the left tube, the right tube, or both. So right now, I'm going to reach over here and key it. Six thousand, right around six thousand volts on the plate, sideband. One two, one two, one two, one two, about uh, twelve fifty, thirteen hundred. So one key it. We'll come down here and turn the other tube on. So now you have uh, both tubes lit. And like I said, you can run either of the either of the the two tubes. The, they both do twelve fifty out. When you switch both on. It changes the uh, input network, so the input SWR is the same. It changes the output network there, so you don't have to do any retuning. So now we got the other tube on. Go ahead and key it up. Uh, one two one two one two one two one two. That's a 2500 watt slug in there. So the way he designed this uh, amplifier to operate is he could be sitting there running CW in the DX portion of the band with one tube on and uh, if he couldn't get through the pileup he flipped the other tube on so kind of a neat configuration and I uh, just wanted to take a video showing that it was uh, back up and running WA QBG dual 4-1000 amplifier